Helping Restore Ability is an organization that can assist people in so many situations. They have services for individuals and families coping with disabilities. Joining me now are TJ Griffith, a board member, and Paul Grabley, the Director of Development. How are you guys this morning? We're doing well. Good. Now, we got to talk, TJ, because we bonded over the blackjack table at the last fundraiser for Helping Restore Ability, Bonded right? and won, and which won is more important. Time. Yes, exactly. <laughs> well, TJ, tell us a little bit about yourself and how you came to be involved with uh, Helping Restore Ability. Uh, well, I, uh, I broke my neck playing high school football years ago, which I like to, it was a good hit. I went out in style. <laughs> if you're going to get hurt and play football, right. do it in style. But... You know, the problem is you, when you get disabled, it's like you want to work, you want to do everything, uh, but how are you going to do that? You, you have to have help. I have to have help to get ready in the morning, get showered, and taking care of things because I'm limited on my dis with my disability. Well, the great thing about helping restore ability is they actually help pay for my attendant to do that. You know, I don't get stuck in a nursing home. I'm not stuck. You know, I'm able to have someone come over, get me ready in the morning, and most importantly, send me off to work so I can do the job that I want to do, you know, contribute to society, pay taxes, do everything, and live my life, you know, to the fullest. As I like to say, the only thing different about me is I sit down and get better parking mm. spaces. That's about it. And <laughs> hey, it's you got to have a, a sense of it, humor, you gotta have a sense humor it, right? But it, because of helping restorability, what they do provide for me and mm. other people with disabilities, it's, a, it's an amazing, amazing organization. It's made my life so much easier after being paralyzed. It's, wow. it's such a good cause. That's why when they offered me to be on the board, I jumped at it. Well, didn't jump, but I tried. I got, I got, I got on as soon as possible. Let's put it that way. I love it. Well, and Paul, tell us about some of the things you guys do because you're obviously helping out TJ and people like him. What are some of the services you guys offer? Yeah, the primary thing we do is we provide in-home care for persons with disabling conditions. It could be some an infant that uh, is diagnosed with autism, mm. uh, or it could be somebody that is is uh, experiencing the disabling condition because of their age. Maybe it's Alzheimer's or dementia, or it could be somebody uh, similar to TJ who had an accident uh, late, uh, later in life, and so they're experiencing uh, a new uh, way of life. And so depending on what the disability is, uh, we provide in-home care, because uh, we don't want people living in nursing homes. We mm -hmm. don't want people uh, have to be in hospitals. Uh, there's evidence over and over and over again that if people can live in their homes and uh, have uh, spe specific care, provided to them, then they do better. They live longer, they live healthier, and most importantly, they're independent. And Which is so important, right? Because there's so many things that can really get you down if you're in this situation, and that way, you, you feel like you're still contributing to society. Yeah. When I was able to go back to work and work full time, I, the emotional lift was so much better. I mean, great, financially, obviously, but the emotional thing of letting you know, yeah, the only thing different about me is I sit down. You know, I'm doing everything. It's because of helping restore ability that I'm able to do that. Right. And yeah. of course, none of this is free, right? You got to have funds to be able to pay for these things to help out. You guys have a big old fundraiser coming up. We do. Well, I, should, I should say we. Yes, we are. Right. We're all right? going to be there, right? So tell me about the fundraiser. Yeah, so the fundraiser is with uh, Marley Matlin, mm -hmm. the Academy Award winning actress who uh, was in Children of a Lesser God. She'll be our featured speaker oh, so on amazing. June 27th at the Dallas Omni. We're really excited about it. There, We couldn't think of a better way to, to celebrate the work of helping restorability and to also share uh, the, the good things that are going on. Um, but we want to raise money, too. Mm -hmm. And so uh, we're very thankful to places like Centerpoint uh, Builders, who are our title sponsor, wow. and places like KTXD, our media sponsor. We're so thankful you're going to be there hosting and emceeing the event. And uh, it's going to be a blast. We'll have lunch, and we'll be silent auctions. It'll, it'll, be, it'll be great. So come on out, spend some money, but have some fun while we're doing it. And, of course, oh, yes. listening to one of the most prolific speakers who can really speak to some of the things and some of the things she's had to overcome, right? Absolutely, yeah. Marley lives with uh, a disability, a hearing loss, and so she spends her time. Uh, one of the conversations that she's going to have with us is about how her life uh, is different but also mm -hmm. the same and how mm -hmm. she has overcome some of those obstacles to be one of the most successful actresses in Hollywood. Well, I can't wait. I know it's going to be a lot of fun, and I'm looking forward to spending some money. I can't stay away from a silent auction. <laughs> it's a bit of a problem. That's so. why we have you seeing right there. No, I'm just no. <laughs> That's the only reason why they asked me, but no. it's going to be a really great event. I'm looking forward to it. Well, Thank you guys good. so much. Well, Thank you. All right, you guys. Here's how you can help out this nonprofit 
nonprofit organization is having this luncheon. Remember, it's Friday, June 27th at the Omni Dallas, and the guest speaker is Oscar-winning actress Marley Matlin. You can find out uh, more about it and a link for tickets on our website or on helpingrestoreability.org. This is like one of those don't-miss type events. I can't wait. So uh, we've actually got a pair of tickets to give away, yeah. which is yes. kind of cool. So right now to caller number five, just call 1-800-994-1547 to win. Good luck. I'll see you there. Come say hi. Can't wait. It's going to be a great event. So thank you very much. It's going to be great. Should I get my phone and try to win those yeah. tickets? Right <laughs> you don't now? get to get in no, no, you're, you're already in. <laughs> <laughs> We're checking out some more great fitness moves um, and tips from our friends at Energy Fitness when the broadcast returns. Stick around. I'm excited about this one.